know I'm doing, I'm blessed, yes. Living every moment, no regrets. Smile up on my face, I'm like, oh, yes, I'm blessed. Well, yes, we are back. And I figured I would bring you and show you my mother's house. The house that I grew up in. Well, not actually the house I grew up in, but the actual same area. It is now, uh, what day is it? June the 2nd? Today is June. June 2nd. So, we just pulled up in Sealsby, Texas. For all y'all that don't know. Sealsby, Texas is probably about 15 miles north of Beaumont, Texas. Now, if you don't know where Beaumont, Texas is, Beaumont, Texas is about 150 miles east of Houston. And if you don't know where Houston is, get you a map or Google it because I can't help you. But Houston is in Texas. If you don't know where Texas is, I don't know what to tell you, but Texas is in the United States. And if you don't know where the United States is, what do you need? What they need to do, Rose? Do a Google map. Do a Google map, or go back to high school because I'm pretty sure you learned that in the third or fourth grade. All right, we're just joking with you. All right, so now the house I grew up in, it got uh, what you say? It got uh, it got damaged in uh, one of the hurricanes that came around here. Now, the hurricane is not Rita. I believe it's Rita, but I would have to look it up to make sure. Because I know Katrina is the one that did. Uh... Ooh, and so if I come out, it's a freaking waltz at the door. So. Yep, he's still flying around. Alright, so I believe it's the uh, hurricane got messed up in Hurricane Rita. The house got messed up in Hurricane Rita. So, the government decided they was rebuilding houses, and my mama finally got her name on the list. So, if you're watching this and you grew up with me here in Silsby, you remember it used to be a big, long, green house. I don't think I have any pictures of it. That uh, used to come around this corner. And here's the house now. If she's had it rebuilt and as you can see now if you can just imagine the house that was here before the front of it was because this bush is still here this bush is old as me and I'm 46 it was there when I was born and it was still two of them so the front door was right here to the other house so then you had a little walkway from between the houses that was right here between these two bushes and this one. And my grandmother's house was right here. So then you had a uh, little area that was right here between it. So then you had Mrs. Uh, Miss Razzy house on this side. And then you had Miss uh, Janie's house. On that side then you had an open area then you had brother Jack's house brother Jack was a, a, a blind man but I swear to God he could see because I would run around playing around his house one day and that sucker hit me in the head with a broom a blind man couldn't do that I still don't understand how he did it so then he tell me say I'm making too much noise messing around his house and he told me to be quiet but when I come running around the corner BAM I got hit right in the head with a broom and as you can see, the church is right down the house from the street. Now, I would have to tell this story in another reason why we're late, but uh, it has something to do with an incident that Rose had done while we was in Waco. But uh, I will let her tell that. And uh, church here started at 1030, and right now it is about 10, 1140. So I'm not walking into a black church late. There's just some things you just don't do. Because it'll be over in probably about another 45 minutes. But this is the church I grew up in. As you can see, I had no excuse for not going to church. Because when my grandmother, Lord bless her soul, Pauline Land. Boy, if you don't go to church, no outside. 
and uh all y'all that don't know what that means that means if you don't go to church you're gonna spend the whole day inside the house nowadays kids would love that because i don't think they play video games but this is before the first sega came out and uh you really didn't have no uh handheld games because this is way before tecmo bowl uh pong and all the other thing you could do is just go in the house and read the freaking encyclopedias so guess what anthony was at church every sunday and then not only at church every sunday i went back for prayer meeting and uh everything that was after school so this was a small little tour of showing you where i grew up but this house is about um, I'll say two years old. Get that. I would have to ask my mom to make sure. Well, about two years old. <laughs> they did a nice job. They do. And she's still here playing with her hair. <laughs> so what are you trying to do to your hair, Rose? So we running late and behind, so we miss going to church on time. So, but she's still fixing her hair like we going. So, all right, people. Hey, enjoy life. Bye. Bye.